Tally trying to lock in another submission here as we are in the underground. Our main event of spring break in week number two. Knockout, TKO, submission. Only ways to win this unique style of matchup. And anything goes. And one more time here, they come to the outside. And the Tally up. Mm, and again, this is about beating respect into Lola of Ice. Shayna Baszler for a half second here seems to be a little bit worried. I see Carmen Petrovic. She's the one who's been in the corner. Natalia teaching her striking ability. But Natalia going back to some old school wrestling with some snap suplexes here on the floor. Sit on top of her game here tonight at NXT Underground. First ever. First time ever. Oh, here we go. And oh! Booker, I don't know if the camera crew caught it or not, but the way Natalia fell, her lower back snapped right there in the center of the table that cracked the monitor. Beautiful leg sweep by Lola Vice, Vic. You gotta wonder now that the feeling maybe in that lower back, how much damage has been done. And Natalia trying to block it out, trying to fight through the pain right now. Natalia, oh, and then she went right into that steel post. Rips, spine first. This could be that opening. And again, it all comes back. For Natalia, how much does she have in her? How much fight does she have in her? Because she knows that Lola Vice does nothing but look down on all superstars, both male and female. Rick, when you're competing, you gotta do that. I mean, it's nothing personal or anything like that. It's business. NXT Universe trying to rally Natalia in this moment, but Lola Vice with every kick is gaining momentum, with every kick is gaining confidence. And you take a look and you feel the atmosphere. Lola Vice could be the face very soon of the best women's division in all of professional wrestling. Is now looking for a submission is Lola Vice. And look at Vice, Vice has her hands up because she's trying to block any punches that Natalia can throw, but she's also locking in that left arm. There's nowhere for Natalia to go. Natalia's fading and now elbows raining down right on top of the dome. You gotta agree with me there. NXT Underground is truly that proving ground, Vic. It certainly is. And we know the history between these two. We know Lola Vice's MMA training, but you've heard the stories of the Fame Heart Dungeon. That is what Natalia is fighting through right now. Trying to fight through the pain. And you see the tape fist. Natalia typically doesn't have tape fist. She knows what she's in for tonight. She's here to beat the hell out of Lola Vice. She's got a hell of a job. Oh, and, oh, quickly. Oh. and look at Shanna Page on the outside, telling her to squeeze, telling Lola Vice to squeeze, locking a vice grip, looking for a guillotine. The NXT Universe on their feet. This place is rocking. Nothing away from what Natalia learned in that dungeon, but the game has advanced so much, Vic. It's the baddest first the best. And look at Carmen Petrovic. Oh, they might have a little bit of worry. But look at Natalia fighting through. Oh, and just dropping her weight oh, right no. down. But not oh, to be no. outdone. And again, you talk about deep waters. MMA background for Lola Vice. She's been in this position before. She's been in this sort of fight. Like an anaconda There's right no now. ropes. Typically, what you would have in a traditional one-on-one -on -one matchup. Natalia having to figure it out on the fly. Wow. And the crafty veteran wow. breaks the hole. Breaks the hole indeed. Wow. What a main event here at Spring Breaking. Week number two. The first ever women's NXT underground match. Natalia from Monday Night Raw. Roll of Ice of NXT. We've been thinking about this all week. Can you imagine what they've been thinking? Oh! Oh, wow! They've been thinking of ways to hurt the other. They've been thinking of ways. Remember, Natalia locked in the knee bar early on, and we've seen her Uncle Brett Use this same sort of maneuver in a figure four. This isn't exactly a figure four, but it's putting pressure all over the knee. And oh, Baszler got a little too close, wow. and Carmen Petrovic had to pounce. I know the pressure of that, that knee right there got to be in a lot of pain. I was actually that same move by Grant the hit Van Hart once upon a time.
talk about the hitman. You talk about the heart foundation. You talk about the sharpshooter. The Italian you, hey! No rules, Vic. There are none. No Baszler, rules. the former partner of Natalia, just got tossed to the side. Natalia turned around, caught the kick, taken down twice. Lock it in, Natalia. Lock it in, Natalia. Oh, baby. Oh, no. Sharp oh, shooter. No. Oh, no. Referee's there for the submission. Vice is in pain. Vice is screaming. She's trying to crawl. She's getting her hands on anybody around her to try to break the hole. But Natalia dragging Lola Vice back to the center. She's got that. She's got that big. Natalia trying to hold on. That back's got to be on fire. Think about the knee that Natalia has focused on. Petrovich, everyone else screaming for Natalia. Hey! The, 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 the Baszler with the Karafuda clutch. Screaming at Natalia. And Natalia going out to save her friend. That Canadian connection we know which is so strong. And making Baszler pay. And now Natalia trying to finish up, but Baszler one more time. Big back fist! Wow! That 305 connects! Right and now right right down for him. The official steps in! This is over! This is over! in that moment as we go back turning point of this underground matchup Basil locking in that Karafuda clutch Natalia relinquished a sharpshooter seconds away from victory to save her friend but the turn around with that backfist, backfist the official had to realize and recognize Natalia couldn't defend herself as right on top with rights, with forearms, was Lola Vice, who knocks out Natalia here at spring breaking inside underground. Awesome. Big win for Lola. She did great. Natty did great. But guess what? Neither of them can touch me. So tell me, Ava, why am I still here? Okay, Roxanne, well, you're still here because earlier when you said, I don't have time for this. I was actually gonna tell you who your next opponent is next week. Next week? Next week? Mm -hmm. I literally just defended this last week and you have an entire combine to worry okay, about. Okay, Roxanne, I don't need you to tell me how to do my job. So next week, you're gonna defend that championship against Chelsea Green. <laughs> Eva, you are so much smarter than P. Head Pearson, Sir Nicholas the Nasty, and you beautiful piece of gold are going to look so good in my jewelry box. Oh. Oh. Ava, you're the best. I think I'm going to love it here.